Hi, my name is Joanna Arwende, and I've had the pleasure to take the Agility and Excellence in Business Unit in my final semester of university. The EcoBright project was created in line with the United Nations Sustainable Development Goal 7, Affordable and Clean Energy, and is focused on educating students on energy efficiency, as well as providing competent solutions to businesses struggling with energy efficiency. My team collaboratively worked to create this project, utilizing our various disciplines to add depth and perspective to our ideas. I was driven to work outside of my comfort zone, adjusting to working on a domestic focused idea as an international business major. At the beginning of the project, I struggled with this as I'm more accustomed to global scopes and projects, but I was able to conceptualize our idea and relate it to some of the knowledge I had gained earlier on in my degree that I had all but forgotten about. Nevertheless, I developed my soft skills, including communication, active listening, and critical thinking, which as highlighted by an infrastructure in place at Transport for New South Wales guest lecturer in week eight, plays a huge role in teamwork, as there were certain angles and areas of the project that took the team longer than expected to agree upon. And thus, by using these skills, I would allocate specific discussions to be had over Zoom meetings and follow up with the discussions through our WhatsApp group chat, as well as catching up one-on-one -on -one with some of the members to ensure we were all on the same page. Establishing an open line of communication as expressed by a communications executive at Crayon, a guest lecturer in week four. Thus, I found myself naturally stepping into a leadership role as the main problem solver and vocal communicator. I was constantly starting conversations amongst the team, encouraging members to share their thoughts. Reflecting on this now, though, I believe that I could have shared more in these discussions rather than simply directing and managing them, as it would have helped ease my initial struggle with the domestic focus of the project. Moving forward, I plan to make a conscious effort to share my opinions and ideas before immersing myself in the leadership role of monitoring and coordinating a team discussion. This is an important goal of mine as I plan to go into the field of consulting and will find myself in multiple team discussions on various projects in the future. So it's imperative that I learn how to direct these conversations without dismissing my own ideas. Furthermore, the agility exercise was eye-opening as it highlighted the resilience I had displayed throughout the project. My team was delegated a project which luckily for me had an international focus. Thus the creation of my infographic was relatively easy as I was back working in my comfort zone. In light of this, it was reassuring to distinctly see my willingness to learn and how resilient I had been working on our project as it showed me that I was constantly striving to produce quality work and contribute effectively to my team, despite not being as knowledgeable in certain areas as others. This is particularly accentuated in my chapter of the project as I drew from ideas I had learned in units like art of negotiation and even a unit from my arts degree network cultures to curate my response and be a valuable member of the team. In conclusion, throughout this unit, I've grown in a number of areas and had a number of things revealed to me about myself. However, my ability to adapt and stay resilient in the face of challenges is a huge skill, one that is incredibly valuable in global management consulting and has rooted my confidence to progress into this field. Alongside this, I will continue to build upon my communication skills to optimize my contributions to team discussions as I work with more teams in the future. Thank you. My name is Fatima Awa, and I am a Macquarie University student reaching the final years of my study. This semester, I was able to complete the Bachelor of Commerce Capstone Unit Agility and Excellence. My Team 1K chose to tackle goal number seven, which aims to ensure access to affordable, reliable, sustainable, and modern energy to all. We developed an organization, EcoBright, which educates students, teachers, and parents on methods of clear energy the outcome we are aiming for is to ensure more awareness on the use of energy and we aim to, to together promote the world towards a more sustainable future. With various disciplines in our group, we were able to apply various commerce We collectively, we completed various team tasks within daily tutorials for, for assignments which allowed us to create relationships with one another and collaborate ideas. We collaborated through brainstorming during tutorials and practical application of all our disciplines by providing an infographic responding to the Bachelor of Science capstone unit, unit project. This collabor collaboration to respond to a varying issue enhanced my employability by developing skills in approaching situations from a HRM standpoint and collaborating with different perspectives. In terms of communication,
In terms of communication, we use various mediums to allow us to collaborate between tutorials on tasks, responsibilities, deadlines, expectations, and just general questions about the unit. We use WhatsApp as, as the main medium of communication, and it allowed us to communicate easily and effectively to ensure we are all across changes and ideas. When it came to working towards the capstone unit, we used Google Docs, which allowed us to collate ideas and our work and allow us to work together clearly and effectively, which allowed me to develop skills in effectively communicating through virtual communication, which improved my employability, as most organisations communicate virtually. As far as leadership, I was able to develop the ability to navigate through challenging situations and tasks. When it came to leadership in general, a member of our team, Matthew Beach, initiated all of the communications and collaboration as a great leader. However, allowed us all to take the step to communicate ideas to the team, which without the feeling of judgment. I believe my continuous collaboration and communication of ideas allowed a physical safe place to develop within our team and brought the best out of each person within the group, which was a great skill that I can advance my employability as I seek to become a HR business partner. As I progressed through the unit, I was able to develop the ability to adapt and navigate through challenge, challenging situations and tasks. This allowed me to be able to work well under pressure, both with individual tasks and collectively within a team. My understanding of the contribution of different disciplines within our group that allowed me to willingly grow and apply HR knowledge to all situations as I understand the value of situation, strategic human resource manager on a practical scale, which I believe enhances my employability within a HR role. The Capstone project ex expanded my knowledge of sustainable development goals and the impact on all organisations and organisations and globally. The application of theories and frameworks around HRM sustainability pro provided value to the Capstone unit. Through considering the sustainability in HRM framework, the initial drivers within an organisation such as our mission and objective and the impact of external political, economic so, socio-cultural and for the context of the project, environmental factors. Hi there, my name is Matthew Beach and I'm currently in my final semester of study at Macquarie University studying a Bachelor of Commerce majoring in Accounting. Outside of uni, I'm currently employed as an intermediate accountant at Smith Hancock Chartered Accountants and outside of uh, university and work. I'm currently involved in the sport of softball where I play coach and umpire and require the application of qualities such as teamwork, leadership, management and transparent communication, all of which qualities are paramount for success. So this semester at Macquarie University and in this capstone unit, I was placed into a group with other university students from different majors where we were given the task of creating a business project with the objective of furthering a United Nations Sustainable Development Goal. As a group, we chose to address goal number seven, affordable and clean energy. And as such, developed the project called EcoBright, which is an Australian-based consulting service that strives to educate and transform society's understanding and use of energy efficient processes. Throughout the completion of the capstone unit, I demonstrated a strong application of teamwork where I engaged and developed a strong working relationship with the other members of my group assisted in facilitating an inclusive environment where each member's thoughts and ideas were fruitfully considered and also constructively engaged with other members and built upon their ideas, which as a result of the inclusive environment allowed for such ideas to be further discussed and to create a unified idea. Such a process which is supported by our lead consultant for cyber resilience at Dell. To successfully complete the capstone unit and its associated tasks, such as brainstorming sessions, project storyboards, and agility exercises, the function of team collaboration was paramount. I believe my ability to display and implement this quality provided strong foundations for the success and completion of such tasks. Throughout this unit, I was blessed with the opportunity to implement my leadership and management skills. As a leader, I took the opportunity to establish, facilitate and drive group discussions. These discussions allowed for us to identify and understand the strengths and weaknesses of each individual, which in accordance with the senior analysts at the Macquarie Group, provided us with a platform to allocate tasks based on these same strengths more effectively. 
Furthermore, I utilized my time management and allocation skills developed from my experience as a coach, which assisted by ensuring our group sessions were well organized and allowed me to provide useful insights for task allocations. Enhanced by the creation of group documents as such as Padlet and Google Doc, the application of my management skills allowed the group to attain an increased level of transparency and allowed for clearer roles and responsibilities to be established. Throughout the completion of this unit and this task, I developed both soft and technical skills. Soft skills included my ability to remain adaptable to changing circumstances, to contribute more positively to tasks, and also to establish open and transparent modes of communication as well as effective time management. Technical skills included my willingness to learn and use new applications such as Paint, Canva, Padlet, and Microsoft applications, and also my ability to effectively utilize AI functions such as Chat GPT. In addition to the practical skills and qualities, I've also developed sustainable thinking. By studying this unit, I now have a comprehensive understanding and realistic understanding of the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals, as I have been given the opportunity to incorporate my specific knowledge of accounting to develop a business project which strives to achieve these goals. I've also been given the opportunity to collaborate with a variety of stakeholders, including my teammates, to develop sustainable solutions, which throughout this journey has allowed me to develop practical understandings of a company's application of corporate social responsibilities. And that's it for today. Thank you very much for tuning in and listening. Day, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Yu Tong Tong. I am a current student who studied the finance major at Macquarie University, and I will be graduating in several months. There are the two assignments I completed in MQBS 3010 Reflective Essay and Agility Exercise. Okay, in today's brief, I will explain my educational experience at Macquarie University, specifically how the unit MQBS 3010 has provided me with abilities that have increased my employability. To begin, the MQBS 3010 unit has proven to be useful in the practical application of finance. I have used my professional experience to provide financial advice, analyze financial data, forecast, and evaluate projects. The guest speaker lecturers have also provided a wealth of industry information and insights, particularly the first session, which featured a senior consultant from Comp and the CEO of the Australia School of Entrepreneurship. Regarding thought reflection, I realized that my development has mostly been assisted through two channels. First, problem solving, where the capital project dramatically increased my capacity to address complicated problems. This requires both my academic knowledge and professional abilities. Second, the capital project has substantially cultivated my capacity to operate successfully in a team, sharpening my time management and communication education abilities. Teams of self regulation. I have recognized a few areas of improvement, including gaining a better understanding of academic knowledge and its application in real world scenarios, appreciating individuals' diverse perspective and value sets, and emphasizing the United Nations Sustainable Development Goal 5 and 10 to achieve gender equality and lower inequality. For soft evaluation, I noticed three significant areas. First, leadership is essential. Second, reliability, in which I accept accountability and responsibility for tasks delegated by the team leader. Third, making a difference by bringing professional experience to initiatives and helping to accomplish the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals.
in terms of my growth my site, I believe that teamwork is essential. Another crucial component is lifelong learning. Finally, I am dedicated to using my professional knowledge to help the United Nations accomplish the sustainable development goal. Hello everyone, my name is Reedy. I'm a student studying marketing management in my university. If everything goes well, I will graduate next month. As for my skill, I have learned brand management and marketing strategy skill in the past MKTG 3011 and the MKTG 303 unit. I use my marketing knowledge to MQBS project, which in fact give help for my team our project. Let's move on to MQBS. First is self-reflection. Through the study, I realized my shortcoming and had a strong team cooperation ability. At the same time, I also learned the important sense of communication and cooperation. The small important sense is that I have ability to self-reflect, find out what I need to improve, and move our action plan besides inspired by speaker allowed to pay more, pay more attention to individual and uh, personal difference. Our sense is, our sense is about self-evaluation is that I have learned knowledge of market, marketing and I have also gained a practical experience of applying marketing theories into real life's case. I also realized that I needed to get more hands-on experience to understand the industry and I needed to understand to apply technology to marketing practice. Apart from learning from SDG goals, I have learned how individuals could contribute to SDG for goodness for general public, understand the social responsibility undertake by individuals. Moreover, is inspired by guest speaker and ideas to think small, plan small, generally move toward big dream, which are accessibility given the goals. Teamwork has always has always important part of my academic style. And, uh, and because of experience, I have learned the importance of ownership and responsibility. The important collaboration collaboration. I also learned that I need to practice my community and the listening skill. What's more, I gained a good knowledge of marketing, including strategy for contact market, market research and all the relevant factors to consider to market skill and analyze user feedback and the targets because delivering of goods my seat is also important to take away of my academic study. I'm not not a free of failure and the nerd the importance of keeping learning and uh, delivering also get inspiration from classmates and colleagues. What's more? to offset the difficult and the challenge. More future personal development goals are practiced prepared to eat more projects, conduct internship and professional programs in workplace and building social connect connection with professional more importantly, I would like to attend more public meeting and share theory to again to gain more industrial knowledge and the social connection. Thank you for listening. My name is Monique and my journey at Macquarie University began in 2019 studying the Bachelor of Commerce degree majoring in Business Analytics. As a student, I am constantly learning and gaining knowledge from others, unit materials and personal experiences. This can also often be tied to my current role as a store manager at OPSM, which requires skills of store and financial operations, team management and communication. The MQBS Agility and Excellence in Business Unit has greatly highlighted to me the importance of good teamwork, application of sustainability goals, and as well as leadership and communication skills in both studies and real-world situations. The Capstone Project this semester required close teamwork in presenting an organisation whose key focus is on improving a certain sustainability goal. Our group of five integrated various skill assets from each individual's majors in business where my background in business analytics explored specific organizational behaviors, modern marketing and management strategies, as well as data analysis. The seventh goal of the sustainable development formed by the United Nations focuses on ensuring a more, ac more access to affordable, reliable, sustainable, modern and clean energy for all. EcoBright was therefore in 
created to achieve the sustainability goal in which we aim to efficiently and effectively promote cleaner energy, energy solutions for Australians. Our group of consultants ensured EcoBright embodies the United Nations core values of goal seven whilst implementing organizational goals, HR and management processes, as well as financial advice. Across my, many organizations and industries, teamwork can be one of the most important and common aspects in the work, workforce. MQ, MQBS and this group project has been a great opportunity to work collaboratively, overcome group challenges and share ideas with various people of different personalities, backgrounds and or views. Our weekly tutorials presented a highly productive time for live collaboration of brainstorming for both agility and capstone projects, delegating tasks and appointing responsibilities, as well as identifying strengths and weaknesses as a group. Having this experience and skill in successful teamwork personally and professionally builds my confidence in team bonding, reflecting and respecting differences in ideas, being inspired by and inspiring others and being reliable in group efforts. This is reflected in our ability to create personal deadlines to avoid further complications for all late submissions. Contributing to team responsibility and initiative becomes important in developing teamwork skills for myself. Having strong communication skills is also of high importance in both a successful team player or leader. Our group of five have kept in strong, consistent communication throughout this semester and across all projects. Through email, live tutorials, and after hours messaging via WhatsApp, I have greatly contributed to the requirements of clear communications by regularly touching base with each other, which creates a positive sense of holding members accountable for their responsibilities and tasks that have been assigned. MQBS and the many learning opportunities through this capstone project has encouraged me to reflect on various skills that have been developed further or acquired. This involves my strong attention to detail, ability to follow tasks with agility, work under pressure and successfully collaborate in teams to reach deadlines. I have gained a further understanding in my previous units of finance, marketing, accounting under the Bachelor of Commerce as presented clearly by my team members. It is therefore through these skill assets that enhance my employability, especially in having direct experience of various tasks and teamwork requirements over the course of six months and its many challenging projects. The sustainability goal has been a significant focus in highlighting the importance of seeking a more sustainable and reliable solution for energy wherever possible, especially being faced with growing technological changes. Where this project has definitely opened and deepened my understanding, as well as concern for a more sustainable future and the benefits it incurs. I have become more aware of the issues and am able to relate to workforce and everyday living aspects.